We're here on a joyous occasion and also um, celebrating uh, National Native American Heritage Month. But we want to today do the groundbreaking for a monument, a monument that will be erected here at the state capitol grounds as a testimony to the California Indian people and in particular the Franklin family. I never thought I'd see the day that we have a native statue that our little kids could come in the future and gather around and it's, it's only um, sitting that the acorn tree is on the other side where we have our ceremony and just very proud moment for all of us. The inspiration behind the monument that we are here to talk about is of a Miwok elder and fierce protector and preservationist, Mr. William Franklin Sr. Largely throughout his, through his efforts, the Miwok dances have continued. We have information about his efforts to keep the dances and traditions alive on an easel somewhere with that description with his bio. I also want to recognize Ronnie Frosted, the artist who will be working to create the monument. This is only the second monument or statue that's dedicated to our first inhabitants of this state. And for me, um, it, it couldn't be more fitting to honor uh, Bill Franklin. I called him grandpa, but he was my uncle. Uh, but that was my dance captain and learned a lot. And I know a lot of people around here from other areas also remember him in the beginning. Wasn't a man that sought a lot of recognition, but was a man of the people and just wanted to teach. This monument that will be constructed and put forward here on the state capitol will start to pave the way for the voices of all California Indian people to be heard in the state legislature and in the educational arena. Today marks the beginning of that voice to be heard in the state of California. Oh,